Hey everybody, it's been out. We're going to be fighting Rollin' Rattle. Okay, I got that right this time. Um, and basically, this guy's the first boss, so all the little fairy thingies we rescued have magically opened the magical force field. Uh oh. This guy's like a giant robot, and there's no missions by the way, so you pretty much just got... Actually, there's no missions first thing up. Oh, I just realized about this fight again. Okay, I just remembered how to do this. So this guy's pretty cool. Um, oh, come on. Yeah, if you can't actually beat the boss, you can just grind up the treasure and and uh, you can actually oh, you can even put that guy on the on the bit there. Uh oh. Ah, oh, come on, I got hit. Uh, apparently missions come up after you beat the final boss. So that's a bit of a there you go, you can get that a hit on him. And then it kind of slides over. So his two attacks are when he steams up like that. And you gotta jump over his stereotypical ground pound attack. And then, he, and then he's got this attack which fires these little missile thingies. The red ones will explode, so basically I think just sand the sand zone will be fine. And then you just gotta wait for the blue ones to come down, which then come up at different heights, which then you can hit them. Oh, and then he's got these things. Uh oh. Oh, and then he drops those. And then he leaves his top exposed, and then he's like a swamp, I guess? I don't know. So basically, what he does is that he does that. And it really annoys me. When he gets these to spin around, and what you gotta do is that you gotta go over to. Oh, was top. So you basically, oh, just gotta stay on him. Ah! Oh, would have been so pro just then, but I'm being so unpro. Up! Oh, he's firing stuff. Oh, I want to get on. Kill them. And what do we get? This. Alright, so you got no. Uh, we'll get it. Check how shit but and the area was cleared, except it's kind of ruined because of the side bars. Stinking 16 by 9, ah. Uh, but, um, the pirate shop just got a new heart vessel, so yeah, you can't actually spam the heart vessels, actually. Actually, you can kind of, but you can't entirely spam them. So what are we gonna do? We're just gonna jump to the next level, because the first level's not gonna be too entirely long. So that's our first boss emblem. Now if you're wondering, well, where's the second world? Well basically, if you remember in the pirate shop, there was a map to every single world. So basically, so basically, uh, every world has a certain amount of um, treasure that you need in order to buy it. Don't you think it's about time you bought yourself a new area map? I just got a brand new heart vessel. I'd pick it up before heading out again. Yeah, um, so anyway, you can get you can, in fact, I can just buy the last area. No, I, I can honestly buy the last area right now. But I'm not going to do it. I'm, I'm going to buy that. I'm going to buy a couple of heart vessels. Or actually, the, the heart vessel. In fact, I'll buy area 3 as well, just for the sake. Um, so, so yeah, you have to 
you have to use up a lot of your money just to do that. Uh, as for as for the heart vessels, you just gotta wait for them to come into stock, which I think there's only five actually. One for uh, each while you complete, and yes, one after you've beaten the game. I think maybe I'm a uh, again quote me, or don't quote me, but correct me. Uh, and so we have figured out South America. Uh oh. Europe's coming in too. Actually, no, that one's Africa. Double action. So, anyway, we're gonna jump right in. Uh, not into, well, three, but. Or two, so. Now we're in the Wiggly Wilds, which has just planes. Should be easy. Yeah. In fact, yeah, that's easy. Don't take damage, that's good, that'll be easy. But we've got an extra heart just for the sake of it. If I can call them heart containers? No, the heart vessels. Completely different. Vessel and container. Completely different things. So anyway, what we gotta do, we gotta beat the clock. We gotta beat it. Uh, and we gotta get the meaning of life thousand coins. I don't actually think 42 is the meaning of life, because 42 is a number. Awesome music. Anyway, these things, you basically jump onto them, then you spin by shaking, and then you just jump up. You jump up. And there you go. Woo! Oh, I missed the one. Oh, I missed the bar. In fact, you don't have to keep spinning after that, you can just kind of keep the momentum going by just jumping straight. Oh my gosh, giant, yep, giant silver coin. So what, we're already 5,000 coins in, wow. We're laying on those 42,000 coins, but think about it, if you get 42,000 coins, then the next area costs 100,000. Do these missions, you make up your money. Okay, got that. Keep going. Oh. This is a cool stage. Look at this. We're in like a tree. Well, this is just a place, but. Oh, gosh. Bombs. Don't want to touch those. I'm going for the health. Oh, yeah. It's also kind of evil here. Wait, what's up here? Oh, the walkway. I feel like someone's gonna interrupt me on Skype pretty soon. What's down here? Hidden treasure? Or oh, secret area? Secret area. With treasure? Or oh, it's got... Oh, it's got treasure, but like... By treasure... Well, that has a ton of points. Good way a ton, I don't know. You can also jump down and keep your momentum. You just gotta pretty much do the initial spin and then you're good. Oh, and just make sure you keep jumping or moving or whatever. Whatever you kids keep doing. See, we're doing fine. We're already up to 19.8 thousand. Okay. Go. Uh. Okay. Ooh, there's our first second. The empty piggy bank. I feel like this may be a bit pain on my way back, but... Okay, let's see how this goes. Um, spin! Spin! Go! Go! Up! Down! Backwards! Holy snap, we're already up here! Dude, we've only got two of the treasures, though. Well, obviously, I'm not gonna get time. Uh oh. No, oh, great. Screw it up. Don't mind me for a second. Uh, wait back. Yeah, I'm just backing it up a bit. Oops, 
kind of missed. Oh, I get. Actually, no, don't, don't retry. Just jump back up. Okay, come well, on, we can do this. Okay, so I guess there's a time path and then there's a. There we go, got it. Yeah, there we go. Either that or this is the time path. Please don't let this be the time path. Erg! I hate it when they do that. They put something right there, and I'm like, erg. This is the treasure path as well, because, like, hidden treasure! Okay, that's good. We're down. Okay, now we gotta jump straight away. You gotta kinda memorize these things. That's... There we go, got that. Oh, we're back here. Okay, we got two of them, that's good, but we gotta do coins. Alright. Hmm. We also got one treasure, so...
magical portal sticking through nests. I'm surprised that a jump like this actually makes it onto that ledge. Oh, diamond! Okay, I got the diamond, that's good. I'm not going for time, so... I guess I can stop dashing, actually. Yeah, I can stop dashing. Um... Um, oh, I get. Well, that's a bunch of coins. Alright. Woohoo! There we go, that's all I needed. And there we go, 42,000. We got the last treasure, that's good. And I'm guessing that last bit just drops you off up, up here. So this is a short stage. Well then again, it is easy for us as it said. Um, so that's good. That wouldn't pass for. Ah, <laughs> uh, so that's that. That was a great run. No fails. That was good. Uh, next time we're going to be going to wavy waters, which should also be easy for us. That's good. More easiness. All right. Have fun, guys. See ya.